We're going to Crabtree Falls. Man, it is cold up here. Horrible planning on my part. What was I saying about the bike easy to pick up by myself? That was slippery. Damn stupid. This walk back up is gonna suck. Yep, sucks. That's pretty cool, man. That is one heck of a view, dude. Yes, you would. It's meadery. They have really good honey from a variety of sources and meat as well. Not just this meadery, but they actually have one in town, Blackheath. If you're not aware, mead is like wine made with honey instead of grapes. That's a hard ride. Oh, it's a sport bike, but man, the hardest hard ride. It just like there's many grapes and many wines, there's many honeys that make many different meads. And I'm stopping here to get honey because it is good with butter. Get some meat too. The Kronos is just, it's got this like touch of vanilla that's just, oh, it's amazing. You can get local honey. You don't have to get local if you don't want, but I just, you know, I want to support local. But this one, the lighter the flowers, lighter the honey. Like some of the cotton in alfalfa is really dark. The wife likes that, but I think it tastes like, what is it, molasses or whatever. I like the sweeter, lighter stuff. We're going to Crabtree Falls, and it's kind of on the way to Wintergreen Ski Resort. This whole area has a bunch of wineries, a distillery, a meadery, a lot of good places to drink and eat. There's some Airbnbs that are pretty dope. But I am gonna take the back way, which is a four bar four trail, and then I'm gonna hike to the falls. It's kind of close to the St. Mary's waterfall. Man, epic. Okay, I know I'm supposed to turn right, but that's Quite the view. Wow. Okay. Man, these are some seriously twisty roads. If you like twisties, like Crabtree Falls is your place, man. Except for this part. <laughs> Every other part had no loose gravel. Really fun, man. Okay. Let's give it a shot. We're off the map at this point. I don't even know if the phone will know where I am, but I'll just keep it on just in case. Man, it is cold up here. Whew. <laughs> I am chilly. It was a beautiful day, like 76, but the sun was out. So, you know, you felt very warm. It wasn't like cloudy or windy or anything. In fact, I don't think there's any wind today, but man. So I think there's like a parking area, but I can't remember. Okay, I was going up, now I'm going down. Maybe this is like a back way. I'm pretty sure you park and you have to walk a mile north. The horrible planning on my part. Let's go right through and then turn left. Going a little too fast here, but I'm excited. Third gear, off-road, you know Jesse's excited. He never goes third gear. Unless he's running from a horse sleigh that's biting him in the back. Ooh, adventure bikes. Nice. What's up, gentlemen? Yeah, he had the banana suit on. I'm feeling left out. I only have like the, the climb jacket. I don't have the, the matching adventure bike suit, man. I believe I'm what the X-Gens would call a poser. But I don't care. I can at least pick my bike up by myself. <laughs> I say that now, we'll see what happens when I'm 67. If I gotta go with the crew to be safe, make it easier to pick up the bike. But for now, the Kawasaki Versus X 300 is, with gear, is easy to pick up. As long as it's not on a weird angle. Okay, now we're going up again. What the heck? I don't know what bikes those were, but they were nice. I'm gonna have to review the footage. They had some really good looking luggage on that. 
Hold on, that might have been a campsite. Let me, let me go back and check that real quick. That did not have a, a private. Ugh. Yeah, let's go check this. This could be like a, a cool campsite, man. Yep, it is, nice. Okay. And you know what's neat? The trees are big, let's see. Those are oak. Are there any deadfall widowmakers? I don't see any. Nice fire pit between the trees. I can put the hammock right there. Check down here real quick. This looks pretty used as well. I don't think I can make it back up that by myself if I got stuck. So let's not. What was I saying about the bike easy to pick up by myself? Whew. Who knows? Ugh. Let's try that again. This is a dope campsite. Room for plenty of vehicles, too. I should have put my coat on. That brief break. Oh, well. Alright. Not bad. Only one squad on this trip. Not bad, not bad. That's what you get for making fun of people, Jesse. Karma! I wasn't making fun. I was just jealous of their big middleweight and heavyweight adventure bikes. But me and the Versus, we can go wherever, right? We good. Man, good campsites. Okay. Man, wow. That's one hell of a view. Wow. Whoa, whoop. <laughs> now I know they call them whoops. <laughs> if you're not looking, whoops. Whoa. That culvert requires first gear, baby. First gear engaged. Stand up. Let's do this. Oh, that man, that's so pretty. Another awesome campsite. Another awesome campsite. Ugh. Okay, now we're going downhill again. Ugh. Another campsite. It's kind of... Wait, that's a trailer. Nice. Is that the parking? Did I just pass it? Am I stupid? Maybe that was it. Yeah, that might have been it. My bad. My bad. I stupid. I don't know, man. I don't think I'm there yet. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep going. Who, buddy? Look at that mud. Whoa! That was, that was slippery. Oh, it's going too fast. Even 17's too fast, really? Okay. Sorry, Jesus. My bad. My bad. Wow, this is like ice. <laughs> It's fun until you fall and freeze to death and get all gross. Going down. Yeah, it's getting a bit steep. Let's uh, let's stay in first, eh? Oh, nice. Parking right there. Let's park right here. We have arrived. God, oh, jeez. Ugh. Dead skunk. Roast. Good news, I only have about maybe four pounds of gear. Very lightweight gear. Enough, like a couple coats in case, you know, something bad happens. Some water, bear spray. And that's it. I don't have my, this is my day hiking setup. I don't have my backpacking setup. You only have to go about a mile point two to get, I guess, the first photo op. I hope it's not too uphill. Maybe it is. <laughs> we'll see. That's some parkour moves right there, you know what I'm saying? What I'm saying, huh?
Okay, I'm stupid. I looked at the map. You can park and it's like not much of a walk. Or you can go around with a 4x4 trail, you drive, park at the trailhead, then walk down like I'm doing. But yeah, you don't have to go this way. If you just want to take your family in a minivan, you are good to go. Although there was a Toyota Corolla there. So if you're brave, you can totally do it. This walk back up is going to suck. This walk down is so easy. That's pretty cool. Uh, that's pretty cool, man. I guess I guess I made the right choice to go to the top. <laughs> Let's go this way. That is one heck of a view, dude. Take the family and we'll do the other way next time. Now it's for the long hike back. Which normally you'd go that way. But I have to go uphill. Yep, sucks, even if your pack is light, because you're going uphill. I wonder if I got in shape, if this would be any easier, probably. Parkour moves. What I'm saying, huh?